he just kind of stands there and is like, uh, I don't know. But we'll see how that one works. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the notification bell so you can get updates every time I upload a video. Also, if you can give this video a thumbs up for my super cool Target homeschool supplies. Okay, so let's get right on in. I did not plan to come and buy anything at Target. I actually came to pick up some diapers that I ordered online, but while waiting for customer service to actually get somebody to get my order, I decided to walk around and y'all already know how that goes. You get in Target and then you just pick up stuff, especially if you go to the dollar spot, okay? So I, I did limit myself, I only bought a few things, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you. I'm not gonna show you the diapers because I mean, well, that's not homeschooling stuff. So um, I did find this world laminated map and it was only $8. It's laminated, you can um, write on it. It's dry erase. I really like it. I think it's really cool and um, it'll be helpful in me teaching the kids about the world. So that was not from the dollar spot, but it was homeschooling. Okay. The next thing I got was some match the letter pictures, letter matching game. So it has the little clip in there and uh, it has pictures of different letters. This one is mostly for CJ right now, but uh, hopefully my must get to it eventually. I also bought some more alphabet cards because the last set we can't find all of them. So I just decided why not. Then this one is for LD. This is kind of, it says my chore chart, but I don't know if I'm going to use it specifically for chores or if I'm just going to include everything that LD needs to do because sometimes he gets really. It's like if he doesn't have somebody telling him what to do, he just kind of stands there and is like, uh, I don't know. But we'll see how that one works. The next one, I did pick up a jumbo coloring book for CJ. It's a Paw Patrol jumbo coloring book. And um, this one is not exactly a supply as such, but it's a backpack. LD's favorite color is yellow. He's obsessed with all things yellow. I saw this and I thought it was really cool. Um, the thing that I liked was that when you're not using it, you can unzip this pocket and tuck it inside. Like that. Tuck the whole backpack into that pocket and make a small pouch zip it and done i thought that was super cool and then we could hang it up take up less space but i got the backpack mostly so when we go like on field trips and things or just anywhere really he can pack his own stuff one of the last two things i only got two things left um one was a digital bookmark i thought that was really cool i wish they had different colors though um because this one is pink but it still serves the purpose that i want He's always asking me, Mommy, have I been reading for 20 minutes? Well, now you don't have to ask me. This, it has the digital countdown um, timer and it has the batteries included. So when he's reading, he can time himself to do his 20 minutes of reading every day, minimum. The very last thing is not exactly a homeschool supply, or at least that's not the purpose for it, why I purchased it. I bought a balloon, a foil balloon with the number nine. If you didn't know, LD's birthday is coming up in October, and he will be nine years old. So I just saw it, figured why not if something that it was only a dollar. It's cheaper than most of the other places that I would find a foil balloon with a specific number. So I did go ahead and pick that up. But 
that's it for my homeschool supply. Well, I guess I should call it my Target Dollar Spot um, haul. And again, if you are new, if you can consider subscribing to my channel, hit the notification bell so you can get updates every time I upload a new video. Also, give this video a thumbs up for savings. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.